Okay, you own a f uh, iPhone 11. Let's go really quick and, and, and talk about some uh, features on this iPhone that you, in the future, you will be able to use your iPhone without using the volume keys or the silent key or the sleep key in case that you're not able to use them because they are they are broken. Um, but uh, it's still going to be able to use your phone with a feature that comes with it. Um, so let's go and open uh, settings of this uh, iPhone 11. Uh, let's go to settings. And once you are in settings, let's go and open accessibility. And accessibility, let's go and uh, use touch. And then as uh, touch, let's go and open assistive touch on the very top of the screen and enable assistive touch. Immediately, you're going to see a shortcut showing up on your screen. Okay, let's go and you can move this shortcut anywhere that you want to have it on your screen. If you talk, if you touch the or you open it, you're going to see a couple uh, shortcuts here. So you touch this home shortcut, of course, you're going to take you to the home screen. Uh, open, touch one more time, the, the assistive touch. And you can... Um, turn off notification or open notification center. Um, if you go to control center, gestures, um, open device and on device, you can, uh, uh, control your volume here, volume up, uh, volume down. Okay. And you can mute your iPhone from here. You can rotate the screen. You can lock the screen. And remember that uh, you don't need the power, I mean, sleep key to power on your iPhone. You only need to charge your iPhone, connect the charger. And once it hits 1% or 2%, the screen automatically will, will uh, turn on or the iPhone will turn on. So you don't need to press any buttons to turn on your iPhone. And that's why this is this assistive touch icon is very, very useful because basically it is replacing the entire, um, your entire iPhone. Okay. So let's go really quick. Okay. So take your time and save or even you can use this shortcut in case that you want to give, uh, you extend the layer of your key keys on your iPhone 11. Okay, so just uh, take your time, go over this one, and even from here, you can take a screenshot. Okay, so this is uh, restart, uh, gesture, screenshot. Okay, so you can take a screenshot from there, and so on. Okay, so um, if you want to turn off the I mean remove or by now um, you want to just remove this icon let's go really quick and just go back to the uh, iPhone settings and open accessibility and then touch and assistive touch it's on so let's turn off okay and now the shortcut has been uh, disappeared on our screen okay so thank you for choosing my video let me know if you have any questions don't forget to subscribe and keep in touch thanks so much